Now here's a look at the latest sports news on New Vision TV. Preparations to host this year's Uganda Muslim Education Association New Mayor Solidarity Games at Kasau Islamic Senior Secondary School are in the final year. This was confirmed by the school director Haji Kasim Kajaya at the launch of the games at Chibuli SS. Only Muslim funded secondary schools under their umbrella association of mayor will take part in this solidarity game. The Umer Games started in 1998 at Chibuli Senior Secondary School. Kasau Islamic was nominated to host the Games during last year's event at Nkoma SS in Mbale. This won't be the first time Kasau is hosting the Games as they did the same in 2015. Now off to Fufu Women's Cup, Lady Doves continued with their unbeaten run this season following their 3-0 victory over Kampala Queens in the round of 16 of the Fufa Women Cup. The Masindi best side who also on the verge to qualify for the Fufa Women Elite League playoffs have extended their unbeaten run to 12 games in all competitions. Kenyan Mary Kinuthia Wanjiku Nafula notched a brace before Winnie Babidia added the other as Lady Doves stormed the quarterfinals of the Women Cup. In other games, Bunyariguru girls went down 2-0 to Toro Queens while Echoes thumped Sagich 4-1. Kawempe Muslim suffered their first defeat this season after being defeated 2-0 by Olila Women FC in Soroti. Olila, Lady Doves, Toro Queens, Echoes, Uganda Matters, She Corporates, Makere, Kawempe Junior Team are the eight teams that qualified for the quarterfinals of the competition. In the 2019 African qualifiers, Uganda Cranes assistant captain Hassan Waswa Mawanda is confident they will overcome Tanzania on Sunday. Waswa revealed this in Cairo, Egypt, where Cranes are undergoing five-day training camp ahead of the last qualifier of the group stages. Uganda, who already qualified for AFCON, is on top of Group L with 13 points, eight above second and third place Lesotho and Tanzania. Cape Verde is bottom with four points. In Cairo, the team will engage in double training sessions morning and evening before playing a practice match on Wednesday against a local club. From Cairo, the team will switch to Dar es Salaam on Saturday ahead of a Sunday tie with Tanzania. In international sport, it is a great start for Chelsea's Hudson Odoi. Chelsea winger Callum Hudson Odoi has described his first call up on the England senior squad as great opportunity. The 18 year old who was initially with the under 21s has now joined the rest of Gareth Southgate side as they prepare for the European qualifiers against the Czech Republic at Wembley on Friday and away to Montenegro on Monday. Hudson Odoi who has scored five times in 19 matches in all competitions, has had little time to impress with London's best side. Manchester United defender Luke Shaw has been withdrawn from the team due to an injury. He joined Chelsea's Ruben Loftus-Cheek and Manchester City duo John Stones and Fabian Delph, who previously withdrew from the team. But Southampton midfielder James Ward-Prowse was summoned on Monday to complete Southgate, a 23-man squad ahead of the upcoming European qualifiers. Fires. Coach Maurizio Sarri is living on borrowed time at Chelsea following reports that he could be sacked any time from now. The Italian is understood to be under immense pressure after an unsatisfactory first season in charge. Chelsea that is struggling to finish in the top fourth in the league can also complete the season trophy less if they don't change their attitude in the UEFA Europa League. But their claims that Roman club Abramovich might now use the international breaker's space to sack Sarri and bring in a new manager. The Blues 2-0 defeat to Everton last Sunday worsened Sarri's stay at Chelsea. Chelsea, who had an impressive first half, did not live to their expectations in the second half. That's the latest sporting update compiled by Shafiq Senoga for New Vision TV. Now for more of your sporting update, visit www.newvision.co.ug forward slash sports.